Hi, welcome to Easy Japan. Today I'm going to talk about the national anthem of Japan. You might have heard of it in the Olympic Games during the World Cup. The national anthem of Japan is called Kimigayo. The origin of Kimigayo's lyric is said to be a waka, Japanese poem from Kokin Wakashu, an imperial anthology of waka which was reported to the emperor in 905. The person who composed this waka is unknown. Since then, the waka appears in many different anthologies. During the Edo period, the beginning of the waka, Waga Kimi wa, changed to the current form, Kimigayo. Wa. After the end of the Edo period, when Japan was rapidly modernizing, they realized that there's something called national anthem in other countries like France and England. Iwao Oyama chose the waka to make the national anthem of Japan, and Kimigayo was composed after some twists and turns. It's also worth noting that Kimigayo was legally established as the national anthem of Japan in 1999. It is also referred to as the shortest national anthem in the world. This is the whole song. Let's see what it means. The English translation is by Basil Ho Chamberlain. Kimi indicates the Japanese emperor, and yo here means reign. So Kimigayo means the reign of the emperor of Japan. Jiyo means 100 generations, and Yatsuyo means 800 generations. So combined with the last verse, it shows the wish that the reign of the Japanese emperor lasts forever. Sazaris means pebbles and Iwao means a huge rock or a huge boulder. Narite means to become. It illustrates the long time it takes for many pebbles to come together till it becomes a huge rock or a boulder. <laughs> Get means moss. Here it shows even longer time it takes for moss to cover the huge rock. About this song, there have been many controversies over the past years. It is because it's generally understood as a song to show the admiration and eternity of the Japanese emperor. As I mentioned, Kimigayo was established as a national anthem pretty recently. After the Pacific War, some people opposed to the idea of establishing Kimigayo as a national anthem because the song recalls the fascism and militarism of Japan, which led to the disaster and tragedy. From time to time, I hear people say Kimigayo is too patriotic. I even hear people say it's uncool. However, according to a research conducted by the Cabinet Office of Japan, 76.6% of the Japanese people think Kimigayo is suitable for the national anthem. As far as I'm concerned, putting the question of the subject of the song aside, the long history is amazing and the poetic expression is beautiful. And you, what do you think? 今日はここまで。<音楽>